please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Good morning, Bombers. Today is Thursday, November 10th, day one. I am Isabella Procia, and I am here with... Alexia, it has been unseasonably warm last week and the past couple of days. I almost thought it was summer for a second. Let's go to Cali to see if we should put our short sleeve shirts away or if we can wear them a bit longer. On Friday, there is a high of 67 and a low of 59 and rainy. On Saturday, there is a high of 63 and a low of 34 and partly sunny with rain. On Sunday, there is a high of 48 and a low of 27 and partly cloudy. That's this weekend's weather. They say laughter is the best medicine. So if you are not feeling well, too well, open your ears because here comes the joke of the day with Julia and Violet. Violet, why did the apple pie go to the dentist? I don't know why. Because it needed a filling. <laughs> That's a knee slapper. It took us all to create a fun and safe learning environment. With students like these, it makes it easy to do. Let's go to Cali to see how they keep putting first things first. I'm here with Jocelyn. What does put first things first mean to you? Do important things first and do the little rocks last. That's amazing. Thank I'm you. What does put first things first mean to you? It means to do the important things first and do the things like playing um, video games after you work. Thank you. What does put first things first mean to you? To me, it means to do like, all the important stuff first so that you can keep your life more organized. And then if you still have time or something to do the fun stuff, you can do that after. Thank you. I'm here with Blake. What does put first things first mean to you? To help people and feel nice and calm. Thank you. I'm here with Molly. What does put first things first mean to you? Thank you, that was amazing. Evelyn. Evelyn. What does put first things first mean to you? Uh, what Thank I'm you. Sadie. What does put first things first mean to you? It means that if I have something important, I have to do that first instead of doing something else I don't need to do first. Thank you. This weekend we celebrate Veterans Day. Chase has a special Veterans Day message for all of our veterans in the community. Hi, I am Chase Evelyn, a sixth grade student at SF Palm. This Friday is Veterans Day and I am here at the Palmerton Veterans Memorial in the Palmerton Park. This memorial was built and dedicated in 2012. It is in honor of the service members from the Palmerton area who have ser who have fought in our country fought for our country. We would like to recognize and thank the men and women who gave, served in the US, US military. We have such great staff in our school. If there was any type of playoffs for school staff, unlike the Mets this year, they would certainly make the playoffs. We want to shout out one of our staff members in particular, Mr. Spedic. This week's staff shout out goes to Mr. Spedic. We think you're awesome and amazing. Even though you don't eat the, eat the cookie part of your Oreo and you have a whole, whole room for your shoes. He helps me with my work. He's fun and he's an under name fan. He's kind and he responds with me. We love you, Mr. Spedic. 
That's it for this week. Please remember to send in your Thanksgiving food drive donations. Also, there is no school for students tomorrow. See you all next week for our tradition, Thanksgiving tradition. Farmers, Farmers out! out.